If you're thinking about buying a house in 2024, there are three mistakes that I've seen my clients make over the last 12 months that you can avoid. So stick with me and I'm going to give them to you. My name is Rich Ganim, local realtor, and these are the three things that you should try to avoid if you're looking to buy a house in 2024. The first thing that you should try to avoid is waiting too long to buy a house. See, clients that waited either waited for rates to come down or home prices to come down, and they never actually figured out how to time the market. And reality is, timing the, timing the market is so incredibly challenging. Most of us can't even figure it out to save our lives. So why should we even try? The opportunity here comes down to does the house meet your needs? And is it a payment that you can afford? And then when rates come down, go ahead and refinance. The second mistake that my clients made in 2023 when buying their house was not sticking to a budget. See, when we work with a buyer, we oftentimes suggest that they go meet with a lender to get pre-approved. In that pre-approval process, the lender is going to talk to you about how much do you want to pay per month in your mortgage? How much can you actually afford based on your income, based on your assets and your debt? The problem that we've run into is sometimes we're like, well, let's just look and see what ten, fifteen, twenty thousand dollars $20,000 more than what I'm pre-approved for. Let's just see what those houses look like. Maybe we can get a deal. Well, what happens is you go and you look at these houses and you fall in love with them and you can't get a deal because that's not the market that we're in and you fall in love with a house that you can't afford and or you're not willing to make that monthly payment on and it's disheartening and it's it's a lost cause, right? The third thing that our clients did in 2023 that we think was a mistake, it, honestly, it seems like it should just be a no-brainer, but it's leaning on us as your real estate agent, as your advisor, leaning on us for advice, suggestions, and support. See, we're the unbiased third party. You're emotionally tied into this purchase one way or the other, right? So when we're the unbiased third party, we can kind of help navigate you through that 10,000 foot view through the corn maze, going go left, go right, don't do this, I don't think this is a good idea. You might hit a roadblock up around the corner. When you trust us to be your advisor, when you trust us and lean on us to allow us to shoulder some of this burden for you, it allows for a much better and happier home buying experience. So those are three things that our clients did in 2023 that you can try and avoid in 2024. My name is Rich Gannam, Cleveland area real estate agent. If you thought this was valuable, go ahead, give it a thumbs up, share this video with somebody that you think could benefit from it. And then while you're here, go ahead and hit subscribe so that in the next video that we put out, you get notified for it. Thanks for watching and we'll check you later.